what's going on guys this is the swansea episode 5 of career mode uh if you've picked up if you remember back two days ago we um sent a future scout so um we've sent a scout out to look for a future player for the future and he the scout has returned and we have got ourselves a dutchman this dutchman is called um joris snyder's um, as you will see in just a moment. It's George Snyder's. He's called 61 overall, 70 to 90 potential. Uh, hopefully it's more than just se uh, 70 to 90. But yes, he seems good so far. And um, we, we, will, um, we will offer him a contract to get him into the full squad. But yes, we do train him. Uh, Beecherman and El Ronto. But and we will simulate it. Uh, yes, he does get a D and a C. Schneider's and his stand tackle goes up by one. So that is pretty good for the young lad already. It's just getting into the squad. For this upcoming match, uh, Owen Jones wanted into the team. So why not? He says, I'm really enjoying football at the moment. And I've been playing so well. So I was like, why not? Let's start you. And Joris Snyder's does accept the contract, so he's coming into the uh, the full squad. So he is. But yes, we did our first game at Liberty Stadium. Swansea City play S Tottenham Hotspur or Spurs, as they like to uh, be called. Also, uh, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith match comedies. Nope. Well, you can probably hear them in the background, but yeah, I'm I'm the commentator. <laughs> Swansea City. Or 16th, while Tottenham are 17th. This is going to be a close game. Uh, seven games in. It's going to be a close game here. Hopefully we can bang in all three points. Christian Eriksen is the player to watch today. He's actually, in real life, he's an absolutely monster, I find. he's played. He plays really well for um, Tottenham Hotspur. And that was a brilliant signing. They signed. But this is our lineup. Fabian Skin Nets. Cal Norton, Fernandez, Ashley Williams, Leighton Baines, Kisong Young, John Joe Shelby, Sigurdsson, Jefferson Montero, Gumis, and Owen Jones are in the lineup. Let's see the Tottenham Tottenham Hotspur lineup now. Michelle Form in that. Kieran Trippier, uh, Toby Alderweireld, Fazio, Rose, Ali, Dembele, Townsend, Chadley, Christian Eriksen, and Kane. In uh, the Tottenham Hotspur lineup, um, but yes, we Tottenham do get the first chance of the game in the fifteenth minute. Brilliant um, pass and play here from Kane and Ants. Christian Eriksen doing two, and doing a uh, one, one twos. But that is unlucky for Eriksen that it goes over the bar. Leighton Baines does steal the ball off uh, Fazio there, and Gomez is one on one versus Michel Form in twenty third minutes. But what a save that is from the Dutchman. I can tell you, this game, Form, got to be the man of the match. He was absolutely fire this game. But here's Leighton Baines. He does shoot. And that is a, that is just wide from uh, Leighton Baines there. On the 25th minute at the Liberty Stadium. Um, so yes, Tottenham do get uh, this goal kick here. They get a chance from it. Harry Kane gets the header and it goes back to Harry Kane now it goes to Townsend well Townsend gets it to Erickson Erickson goes to but that was a brilliant tackle from Ashley Williams and we do get an attack here from Cal Naughton and Ki Sung Young Cal goes back to uh, Cal Naughton Cal Naughton plays a brilliant beautiful ball from Jefferson's Montero and Jefferson Montero fake shots and passes it out to Sigurdsson and Sigurdsson Unluckily there that um, he does not score. The Dutchman making a save. But Cal Naughton. But that is a brilliant defense and block. Look at this. Deli Alley hits it to. Uh, hits it. Hits um, Ericsson with the ball. And it goes. La it hits Ericsson up. And it lands straight into Gomez's feet. And Gomez strikes at the ball. And scores. To put us in the lead at the Liberty Stadium here. That was just. Uh, I don't know what Deli Alley was doing there. And that was actually unlucky from Michel Form there too. Because he, he hits his hands. And he hits off his hands and goes in to get the first goal of the game. 
But yes, that was that was a burning goal from Gummies. Just thought that was don't know what Deli Alley was doing. And again, Deli Alley losing the ball to Gummies and Gummies is one on one, but the Dutchman making a brilliant save again. And that is half time. Now this is the half time stats. We have eight shots, six on target. We have absolute hammering spurs here. With um loads of attacks in this game. That is um just unlucky that um we're we're not we're we should be winning by more at this Townsend. But Townsend gets a sh lovely shot here, but it is off target, unfortunately. I just love the way he shot that there, but I was unlucky that it was not on target. But our new man, Joris Snyder's does come on. Uh, of course, he just joined the full team from our uh, youth academy, and uh, we do get an attack here. Fabianski passes to John Shelby, then Ki Sung Young to Schneider's. And look at this lovely ball from the young fella, the young Dutchman. But that was unlucky from the Gummies there. We get another chance. Owen, the Welshman, Owen Jones, fake shots it, then he runs. But that was a brilliant save from Mikel Form there. Um, yes, but the full-time whistle does blow, and it does end. Swansea 1, Tottenham Hotspur 0. So we do get the win. Look at that stats. 10 shots, 8 on target, when they have 4 shots, 2 on target. So we absolutely played absolutely well in this game. I was so happy with that performance. But yes, we go into our second training session of the game. Look at that, Snyder's getting an A in El Rondo, and his interception's going up twice. And we got another train session though, and it's the same basically for, it's the same for Schneider's, and, but he, do, he gets an F in El Rondo, he gets from an A to an El Rondo to an F. But yeah, Canada, I've uh, put on an offer to sign me up for their team, but I stall it, because I'm still thinking about it, I think it'd be fun. Uh, managing Canada, you know. But yes, here's Swansea City versus Stoke City at the Liberty Stadium. Two home games in a row. That is, um, as again, uh, we go, we got move up to ninth. Actually, we move up to tenth. Stoke City's just ninth. So if we if we get the win in this game, we go up to fifth. And fifth would be pretty cool to go up to, to be honest. But yes, there we go. Here's the here's the players to watch. Look at that, Andre Ayew, top assistsman. So it is, and I think I should put my phone inside because I think you can hear it. And um, yeah, <laughs> Wait, here's Andre Ayew, of course, looking at him, top assister. <coughs> but here's the lineup: Trammell, Naughton, Fernandez, Williams, Baines, Ki Sung Young, Shelby, Sigurdsson, Ayew, Gummies, and Wayne Rightledge. Here's the Stoke City lineup. Jack Butland and Nets. That's all I can remember. <laughs> Jack Butland and Nets. Johnson, Munez, Mun <laughs> Cameron, Peters, William, Shakiri, Bojan, Van Ginkel, Anarnovic, and Chief are is in the Stoke City 11 men lineup. But yeah, look at this. We got our chances game. Gomez, bang. And that is a brilliant goal from Gomez. He is seriously on form at this minute in time, Gomez. He's probably been player of the season for me so far. Um, so uh, he's just banging them in for Swansea City. And that is a brilliant three ball from John Joe Shelby there, if you can see. Yeah, it was a brilliant ball and a brilliant shot. Unlucky to Jack Butland though, getting his hands on, it hits his elbow and goes under his arms into the back of the net to make it Swansea 1, Stoke City 0. No. That is his fourth goal in the Barclays Premier League. But we do get another chance here. Gomez um, does destroy their defence and that is a brilliant save from Jack Butland on the 50th minute here. Uh, we get a corner here, whipped in by Ki Sung Young, and Ashley William gets on to the head, but that um, is an, that goes down as an own goal for Stoke City there. Munez hits off his foot and tricks Jack Butland, and it goes into the net. That was a brilliant header from Ashley Williams there, though. 
And we go 2 0 up in this game. Absolute hammering, well, procession wise and shooting wise, we're absolutely hammering Stoke here. Um, so, yeah. Mark Muniz, if I said that right, I probably haven't said that right. I need to Google how to say that right for just when we play Stoke again. But here's Gomez again. Vic just absolutely destroys the middle of the left, the defence. Let's make it Swansea 3, Stoke City 0. Here at the Liberty Stadium, we're absolutely, we're absolutely thrashing Mark Hughes' side in this game. Uh, 64 minutes in, only two. So can we get another goal? Because we have half an hour. So um, yeah, might as well get Liberty Stadium shouting, "We want four! We want four! Yeah, but it's three 0 so far, and that's his fifth game for Go Mace. Um, but yes. Uh, I don't know why I went black there, but yes, here it ends 4 0, so it does. Uh, my PVR actually, I'm so sorry, my PVR cut a game according to finds cut out the fourth goal. And would you believe it? Uh, Schneider actually scores. He is from a corner, he's j he was just, I can't believe it cut out at this exact moment because he came on, he came off the bench, and as soon as he came off the bench, the corner was whipped in and it lands to the man and he does bang in the goal. I just I went nuts when that happened. I was so happy when that happened, but so sad that it didn't show for some reason. But yes, it does end 4-0 and I will this episode will end now. So hopefully you enjoyed guys. Uh hit that heart but or no hit that like button if you enjoyed. Uh give me feedback in the comments if you have any feedback and uh, if you haven't subscribed already, please do. Look at that, six shots, six on target. And Stoke had two shots, two on target. Well, I'll see you guys. Hopefully you subscribe if you aren't already. Peace!